Crew, maybe Graham is past his prime. Over the hill. We haven't seen Jermaine Cole in the game all night. This is a lot of the best from the game coming out here and letting this be the outcome. Ben, what do you think the issue is? You know what, Stephen A? I don't like your attitude, kid. But if I'm gonna keep it all the way 100, you're supposed to have faith in our boy Aubrey Graham. But the word around town is the boy's washed up. They saying he, he got ankle issues. He's too jacked up on Honda. I think he drank too much Honda, my damn son. Then he just bought a big ass house, mansion, ranch in Houston, Texas. The boy might be on tour. I don't know what it is. But if he don't get it together tonight, this will be detrimental to light skinned brothers across the globe. Do you hear me, Stephen A? So we need him to get it together, stand on business, and, and, and that's all we can say. Let's get back to the floor and see what's going on during halftime.
It's a fight to stay popular. It's a fight to stay relevant. And the only thing that we have to keep us alive is the 17,000 beautiful people in this room that buy the tickets to come out to this motherfucking show and keep us alive. So, this show is dedicated to you. Not my fans, my family. I consider you family, you know? I read a quote today. It said, I said this in the prayer circle today too. It said, you are the average of the people that you spend the most time around. And to be honest, I've dedicated my life to sharing my experiences with you and therefore I'm around you the most. So I am the average of each and every one of you. I would be absolutely nothing without you. Anytime I get a compliment, anytime somebody says something nice about Drake, it's because you made me this way. So make some motherfucking noise for yourself and thank you for still coming out. All right, with that being said, I'm only gonna ask you one favor tonight. It's the most important favor and the most important gesture at every show. So I'm gonna take this second and I need you to do this for me. You never know what the next person is going through, right? You might have some people in here that are smiling, but maybe their day is fucked up, maybe their week is fucked up, maybe their life is a little fucked up right now. And you never know, people can put on a good front. So what I want you to do, before we go any further, I want you to turn to the person either in front of you, to the left of you, to the right of you, behind you. Make sure it's somebody you don't know. Don't turn to your friends and make it easy. I want you to turn to somebody that you do not know and show them some motherfucking love in Tampa. Make their day. Just give them a compliment. Give them a hug. Anything. Anything. Show some love in Tampa tonight. On this side, show some love in Tampa tonight. What's up? This right here. This, this is not a white flag of surrender. This is called a receipt. You know when girls be like, I got the receipts. This is a receipt. Tonight, tonight, I'm giving away, because I want to show the love in Tampa too. Tonight, tonight I'm giving away, we all start light tonight. I'm gonna give away 10,000 tonight. I read your sign. First of all, there's two things I like about you. I read your sign. I'm gonna use this receipt to uh, wipe my sweat for a second. I hope you don't mind. I read your sign. It says, I worked 52 hours of overtime to see you. And you got on a light up jacket, I can't miss you. So this is your receipt. You can cash it in with you. Enjoy your $10,000, baby. Make some noise for me. Where's all my Tampa Bay ladies at? That's what I really need to know. Thirteen hundred hours is crazy. Thirteen hundred hours is crazy. You know what? Give her ten thousand too. Thirteen hundred hours is crazy. That's insane. All right, sorry. All my Tampa Bay ladies, where are you? Sorry, let me see. Can I uh, Can I take y'all back in the day? See if you remember some shit real quick. Is that okay? Come on. Right. I said, 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 I
Everybody on the floor, one more could I really ask you. 
2016 is the last time I came to visit you. I'm beyond happy to be here tonight. This is my, this is uh, our first stop on a new, new edition, new uh, installment of the It's All A Blur Tour. We could not have picked a better crowd. Tampa, you are turned the fuck up tonight. And like I said, like I said, we just getting started, so let me take the shot and I'll tell you what's about to happen next. All right. Before we go any further, you know, I like to turn my uh, shows into a party. You know, a lot of people like to stand up on stage and take themselves all serious and act like it's, you know, just... They don't see anybody and they can't, you know, I, I like to be with the people. So what I want to do is, I want to dim the lights in here if that's okay. And I want to turn this into a club for a bit. I want you to, I want you to be grateful for your life though. I want you to be grateful for your life. If you came with your friends or your family or your man or your girl or whoever, I want you to be grateful for your life. Enjoy yourself, put your arm around the people you love, have some fun. Take it easy, take a breather. Life can't be that serious. We gotta love each other and love our time on this earth. So I'ma play some classics. You enjoy yourself, that's your only job. Cheers.
time tonight. We talk about a lot of things in our career that we be up here and do this show for y'all. As opposed to, look, I'm gonna be honest, as opposed to doing it in the big cities that might expect it, we came right here to fuck with the real ones, the most turn, the highest level. That's the first thing. So thank you to my brother for making something that we talked about a long time come true. I appreciate sharing the stage with you every time. Second thing I wanna say, I want to check I'm only going to get one chance to do this. Okay. okay. Somebody else got to do it. Tampa Bay, while I'm on this stage right now, and Drizzy Drake is in fucking Tampa Bay, Florida, can we please get this man his fucking flowers right now, please? That's a lot of love, Tampa. My brother's showing love. Second thing I was gonna say is unlike everybody else in this building, I've heard the J. Cole album, and that shit's a classic. Just saying, I just want to flex. Unlike everybody else, I've heard a little bit of it, I know. So I hope everybody's ready for the fall off. Another classic for my brother. Third thing, okay, I know, I know what they want to see, but I, I got a challenge for you tonight, though. It's, it's called a uh, Remember Your Verse Challenge. 
it's, it's called Remember Your Verse Challenge. I want to play a song that's so old that I don't know if either of us are going to remember the verse, but we can try it. Should we try? Fuck it, let's try it. Fuck it, let's try it. Like I got a job in IT. Probably with me is your biggest mistake. Thought of them niggas be looking at you. Like we recruited your homies to beat them and think 
day got away from the bar, man, it's shit like a prison escape. Everybody step up for fucking it. Everybody promise it.
to yourself. All right. The last order of business. The last order of business. That's about the people that did us wrong in 2023. You know, I'm a positive guy, but sometimes you need your revenge, it's warranted. For the people that fucked you over in 2023, 2022, 2021, 2020, any year before this one. For the people that ever did you wrong, Tampa Bay, I want you to turn the fuck up. And remember the fact that you're still here doing better than everybody else that tried to fuck you over. Man, that shit. Are you sure you're ready? Yes! Yo. My notepad called many bodies. Screenshots are plenty problems. Voice notes bad, plenty hotties. Can't just talk to me like anybody. Can't just talk to me like anybody. Bitches know that I'm a somebody. And no baby back, she got it. Drink! 
love you with all my heart. This was truly the greatest welcome back I could ever ask for. Everybody on top, make some motherfucking noise for yourself because you're shaking the floor right now. Everybody in this middle section right here, make some motherfucking noise because you were shaking the floor tonight. And everybody that's on the floor, what the fuck more could I really ask you for? Make some noise for yourself tonight. All right, this is what we're gonna do. Don't go nowhere yet. I got one last thing. Like I said, this show, as much as there's love that we're spreading around, this show is about to get back. Because sometimes, life kicks you in the face, puts you down, maybe makes you feel like there's no way out, no way up. And you gotta get some get back. This is a show about warranted revenge. Revenge is justice. I want you to understand in this life, it's not easy. None of this is easy. Whatever it is that you wanna do, you might have to be relentless, you might have to be ruthless. My advice to you, make sure you surround yourself with people that have a vested interest in your well-being. You understand what I'm saying to you? I don't mean start becoming friends with people that come around when shit gets good. I want you to keep the people around that were there before it was good. And if they change when it gets good, then fuck them too. But I want to end the show like I like to end most nights in my life with the ladies. Ladies, I'm gonna give you a chance for some revenge tonight. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do one last song, right? I'm gonna do my part, but I got a gentleman who was a kind volunteer, a Tampa Bay resident. I'm gonna have a bucket over his head, right? And if you sing Scissors verse loud enough, if you sing Scissors verse loud enough tonight, you ladies can get some revenge on all us fellas by. Well, you'll see what'll happen, I'm just saying. But that's only if Tampa Bay still has that energy. I could go on, I could go off, we could all go home if I don't want it. It's up to you. Ladies, you want it? You want some good back tonight? All right, well, y'all let me know when you're ready to bring up our victory. Let me know when y'all ready to bring up our victory from Tampa Bay. Who we got tonight? Oh yeah, you're representing all of us, buddy. You gotta sit down real quick, what's up? What's your name? Max? All right, ladies, this is Max. He's representing men as a whole tonight. So, if y'all want this to happen, I told you what you gotta do. You just gotta sing scissors verse as loud as you can and get your revenge on any man that you've ever had a problem with in life. Are y'all ready? Yes or no? Max, I apologize, but you're taking one for the team. I love you. I would've done it, but this chrome heart jacket is too expensive. You ready? All right, let's go. You think they sang loud enough to, uh, to get back? Y'all want some revenge on Max, ladies? Yes or no? You gotta tell me. You think we should do it? Yes. All right, hold on. Exactly, that's what I said too. Oh yeah, Max. I don't know what you did in your life, brother. I don't know if you've been a good guy or a bad guy to girls, but unfortunately, Tampa Bay, they want to see you pay for all our mistakes. So, on behalf of Tampa Bay, I apologize, brother. Ooh! You must be a good guy there in the slime, bitch. You must be a good guy. Make some noise for Max one time. Make some noise. You must have done something right.
fight in your life, guys. That shit gets the fuck out of you. Tampa Bay, make some noise for my band one time from Rich Baby Daddy Man. Make some noise for my beautiful dancers working their ass off tonight, literally. I'm going to say this. Tampa Bay, these are the words that I'm going to leave you with. If y'all can stop the uh, keys and shit, but we're not in church, I don't want to say this over there. If y'all are smoking tonight, it's Friday. If y'all are smoking tonight, Tampa, make sure the smoke is good. Hey, if y'all are drinking tonight, make sure the drink is good. And last but not least, Tampa Bay, if y'all are fucking tonight, make sure the sex is good, exactly. Y'all get home safe, I'm not doing without you. I go by the name of Jersey Drake. If you're here on Sunday, I'll see you Sunday. And one promise I will keep to you, I'll never stay away from you this long ever again. I love y'all, have a good night, thank you.